Hi all and welcome back to part 2 of my very first let's play of the, at the moment of recording, brand new game, Transcendence Legacy, Void Swept. And before we continue our investigation of this ruined village, I just want to say that if you happen to enjoy this video, this series, or even better this channel, I would love it if you drop the like or sub. And I would also love any type of comments because that's the only way I know if you like this or not. And having said that, it's time to actually talk to the people of this ruined village that we arrived to at the end of last video. So these... Are these pets? Pet the dog. Woof. Well, that's nice. You have pet the dog one times. <laughs> You have pet the dog two times. Okay. We are on a roll. We need to pet all the, the cute animals. Pet the cat. You have pet the cat one times. Okay. We have to be uh, equally as nice to the cat. So, one more pet. Yes, indeed. I've pet the cat two times. Are they the only cute animals in the village? Oh, we have a chest. Oh my, that's uh, that's money. I think we've seen all the houses, but there's another chest. And here's something. Oh, a chest key. So one of the things that we missed in the misty woodland was um, that we at least had one chest that we couldn't open because we lacked a key but it looks like it's story locked for now Toll! Need something friends? Okay, so we can sell some things but not a lot We can buy life flask Anima Flask, Spirit Pot, Pasma Pot, Revival Palm, and Remedy. I think maybe we should buy two of those. These are sort of expensive, but let's buy one. Because now we have a little bit of everything. Lucy, oh my, welcome. Oh, I need more skills and skill shop. I need more skills, of course. But you have to bring me ancient knowledge times two so I can research new skills. Great ability one has been added to the quest journal. Tutorial, Scientia Potentia Est. Characters can learn new skills from skill book items. Use the skill book item from the item menu. Then select a character to learn the skill. A skill must be equipped first before it can be used in battles. Equip unequipping skills can be done from the skills menu. Oh, okay. I see what we're saying. Vigor shards deal strong weapon based physical damage to a single foe. Benevolence. We know this one. Cleanse. Cures status ailments of a single ally. Ignis deals fire magic damage to a single foe. Deals ice magic damage to a single foe. Deals lightning magic damage to a single foe. And winds. So that was Ignis, Glacis, Tonitrus, and Ventus. Uh, let's get one of those. I kind of like the fire damage, but let's... Okay, so now, let's see if I get this. So, we have some skills. Zarth has only... Oh, so he has four more slots. And she already has Benevolence. So it would be cool if we could give him... Let's see, skill book, Benevolence. And have him... 
with that as well. So now, hopefully, whip. That is cool. So now they can both do some healing. Which is nice, I think. You never know when that could be needed. Grant needs something? I need better equipment. Ah, sure thing. Give me the materials and I'll provide you with better gears. I need smithing material times two. Better armed one has been added to the quest journal. Oh, so no tutorial. Um, let's look at the quests. All quests. Yeah, that one we had. And this one we will get on with. So what does this one do? Better armed one. Grant will provide you with a wider selection of equipment if you bring him the necessary materials. And I... Yeah, Lucy will provide you with a wider selection of skill books if you bring her the necessary items. We need more items. Yeah, I have to. Love you, doggy. Okay. I don't think there were any more people here. And if I try to go out here, it'd probably say the same thing, like, talk to Zarf. Oh, no, to Shar. Yep, let's do that. Sure. Finished looking around? Come, follow me. A great catastrophe devastated this world a year ago. A dark cloud of emptiness shrouded the land, giving birth to those monsters. You've seen them. Those malicious creatures brought destruction and ruin across the entire world. The civilization of humanity collapsed in just the blink of an eye. Kingdoms fell, villages destroyed. Then, strange ruins started appearing throughout the lands. We are one of the few who remain to survive until now. Some desperately tried to survive in this ruined world, while others fall to despair, hopelessly waiting for their inevitable demise. But I... But I refuse to give up just yet. I want to seek the truth. What could have possibly brought such a catastrophe to this world? Was this a punishment from the heavens? Or perhaps something entirely different? Regardless, I wish to find a hope for humanity, however small that hope may be. I've been gathering allies, survivors who share the same sentiment, to aid me in my mission. Sorry, and climbing was it? Would you join me in unveiling the secrets of this ruined world? I may not be much of help, but perhaps you'll be able to regain your memories and attain whatever you may be looking for along the way. We know nothing of this world, and we have nowhere to go. I think it would be best for us to stick with you. You have my thanks. It's relieving to have more trustworthy allies on our side. We are currently investigating one of the strange ruins that appeared after the catastrophe. My friends Zeon and Zelina are already there. We should depart from uh, for there whenever you're ready. Fast travel unlocked. Another tutorial. You can now fast travel to other locations by interacting with campfires and choosing the fast travel option. Party management unlocked. Allies will now appear at campfire areas. You can interact with them to add, remove them from the party. 
The quest Illuminated Palace has been updated. You can now fast travel to the Palace of Light Entrance. Uh, yeah, after joining Shar's calls, the party decided to depart for the Palace of Light to catch up with Shar's friends and investigate the area even further. Objectives explore the Palace of Light and you get another elixir. Okay, very nice. Oh, so if you go out there, okay, okay, I see what, 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 what's been said. So now we can go back here. Okay, that's uh, that's not bad. What's the matter? Let me know if you need anything. Okay, very cool. Now I just have to remember where that chest was. Oh, there it is. Okay, so now he should have, yes, benevolence. Very, very good. Oh, they all have the same rank. That's good. Very, very good. Okay, so one thing I kind of realize is that the enemies are no longer following me. So maybe that's because we've already been in this area. So now it's kind of up to us if we want to grind them or not. Yes! Power card one and ancient knowledge. Um, okay, so what was that? Oh yeah, yes, yeah, so we have one of those now. It's good to have that sorted though. Might as well deal with these as well. Okay, would you stop hitting climbing, you meanies? Oh yeah, another thing is that on the way out, I can hopefully find my way back there. There was an ordinary chest, I am almost certain that we did not get. Oh, here we go. There it is. Getting some of that XP. Okay, let's open this chest. Okay, very good reason to go back. We got 530. Yeah. Really truins. Safe area. Okay, before we head out, and we will head out. Where are you, kitty? We have to make this fair and square. times. Okay, what will you do? Fast travel or save game? So what happens if I try to go out here? Will it only give me the fast travel options? Yeah, okay. Palace of Light. Mysterious palace filled with bizarre rays of light. These lights feel so mystifying. Where do all of these lights come from? I'm not sure, except this place is filled with an ominous holy aura. Yes, I can feel it as well. Anyways, we should catch up to Sion and Zelina. They might have found something. Palace of Light, danger level 5. 
Not sure what that means, because I'm not sure how high that got. Charge. Petrified Knight and Skeletal Warriors, and we know nothing about their weaknesses, because we've never seen them before. But they are dead. So I don't think poison will do much. Holy should do something. Got ourselves a skill up. Ouch. That hurt. still hurt even though we have the fortification going. Nice. Hey, we have ranks up! Zarth has reached rank 6, and so has Clamy. And we got some battle spoils. Let's use... Okay, two of those. Okay, let's try this, even though I don't think it's the best... No, I thought so. Ouch. Okay, he needs to do a bit of defending. Skeletal bone. Okay, so now we don't have... Yeah. Is this gonna be a thing that we always look for uh, keys? Oh, there's a chest. Another 420. Thaumaturgist. I think we'll try once again some of that. Okay, that was good. Why is he defending? Never mind. We can also do that. If that's the way you want to have it. This is probably going to end up with you dying, though. He defended his way into death. And we have a rank up. Char has reached rank 6. Cryptic Parchment. What is that? Very cryptic indeed. Oh, there it is. Can be sold at shops. Okay. So it doesn't really say. Oh, and I will. First time through an area, I will almost always do all the battles because I think. It's fun, and also we might need the level ups, so to speak.
We are definitely getting some... Uh, some experience. Yes. Yes, we are. Okay, either we can... Let's go with the door. Oh yeah! Very nice. So what's this door then? Locked. Comprise the Lux Key. My shame. Definitely the right choice. I would imagine that those are our two missing friends, but we will clear this area first. Not bad. So they're up there, but what's down here? One of those thaumaturgists again. Get a bit of MP back. Chest key, ancient knowledge, spirit pot, and revival bomb. We have enough ancient knowledge. Oh, he's back. Hello. We have enough ancient knowledge to actually learn a new skill, I think. Or have her learn a new skill. It's more... more great. Another rank up, rank 7, and some spoils. Charge! Might as well, might as well. Yeah, he can do that. My poison will still hurt him. Yeah, like that. Just like that. Bandit leader, surrender all of your possessions or else. Uh, Jar, Sion, Selena. Ah, Jar, good timing. Hmm, more nuisance. Deal with them, boys! We have Bandit Mage and Bandit Fighter. Nice. That worked. Haha! -ha. Uh-oh. That was bad. Let's see if this works. Not bad. Okay, that's rude. One down. Good decision, as it turns out.
What was that? Sort of a special thing? Probably was. Get a rank up. Shower has reached rank seven. In these desperate times, there are also those who would fight others to survive. Survival of the fittest is a chaotic world for us humans out there. Hey, you're late, Shar. Ah, I apologize. I had an encounter with a strong monster in that misty forest. If it weren't for these two, things might have ended differently. And these two are? Oh! Nice to meet you! I'm Selena. And this over here is Zion. He's quite talented when it comes to magic. Well met, my name is Sai. Let us keep the introduction short for now. We shall carry on with the investigation. Right, let's go. Oh, who? What's up? Need anything? Add to party. Can we join both of them, or are we... Hmm, what is it? Add to party. The party's full. So what does she do? What skills does she have? Oh, well, she's a fighter type, I think. Which is kind of cool, but... Left the party and let's add Zion. Deal slightly magic damage to all foes and life drain. Okay, that seems like a good combination for sure. I also feel this is a good place to end off this second part of the Let's Play. I hope you had as much fun as I certainly had, and that you might hit those like and subscribe buttons. I also hope to see you again in the very next part. But for now, it is time to say bye-bye.